Any, any French speakers in the chat? What did that lady just say? Was that even French? It might not have been French. If not in the chat, can somebody in the comments get me covered here? Because I've always wondered what that lady's saying. Uh, bonjour. Baguette. Oh, I see we have some natives in the chat. Um, <clears throat> gonna play some Plutonia for you today. Got some lovely art from Pansex today. P-A-N-S-E-C-S. -E Hope you didn't think I was saying some kind of naughty word on Twitch.tv there. Uh, I like this a lot, though. And I didn't... I, I like the ones... Some of the, some of the arts say the stream will begin shortly. This one says the slaughter will begin shortly. And you can't spell slaughter without laughter. So I hope we have a lot of fun and a lot of laughs. Uh, but no, this is great. Thank you, Pansex. Uh, that's right, we're not playing The Binding of Isaac for once. I did it, I beat the game. I beat The Binding of Isaac. So that's, that's the way I'm gonna phrase it. Uh, so thank you, Pansex. Very cool. Uh, we're gonna, we're gonna keep going with some Plutonia. Uh, let me just get the window open here. I just loaded the last save from the last stream. Uh, and, pardon me, I'm gonna blow my nose. Okay. Uh... So, we were on level, what, 23, I believe? I think? Yeah, tombstone. Oh, what do you want on your tombstone? So... We got a little glimpse of this level before... Oh good, it's Chain Gunners. So to those of you who have not joined us for the last few, or for any of the Plutonia journey, this is a uh, very popular fan-made WAD for Doom 2 that got an official release as part of Final Doom, which was this sort of enhanced re-release of, I think, Doom and Doom 2, if I had to guess. 
It'd be super weird if it was only Doom 1. Uh, what just hit me? What? Oh, I'm inclined to reload a save. Hold on. Oh, quick load isn't actually quick. Okay. Hold on. So, this is an infamously difficult Doom wad. And yes, much more difficult things have been created since. But this is like... At the time of it being released, it was like the most difficult, commercially available Doom wad. And one of the people who worked on it was Dario Casali, who would then later uh, go on to be hired by Valve and work on Half-Life 1. So all those, uh, Vortigaunts teleporting in behind you in, uh, in Half-Life can likely be blamed on that guy. Oh, hello. So yeah, uh, there's a lot of revenants in this, there's a lot of chain gunners, there's a lot of pain, very little pleasure. Ah. A lot of these bony fucks, a lot of the dudes with the, the, with the chain gun, and a lot of dudes that light you on fire and revive dead enemies, which is a huge pain in the ass. But it is fun. All that being said, this is pretty fun. It's fun to overcome something uh, that's just insane like this. Oh, how did you get out of your cage? Who let you out? I think this is just a different revenant. Okay. I, like, theorized my, like, melee hit strat on those guys ages ago and have barely ever used it even once. But there, I kinda did it. Uh, okay, and we enabled quick save last stream, so a lot of these levels should be going by a lot faster. Wow, you're a really cool guy, aren't you? That's neat. Just go ahead and kill me, then. I don't think we'll be using the quick load button very much. Mostly just quick save and then killing myself to, uh, to load. Hello, auto-aim. Would you like to work today? Oh! Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Just go ahead and kill me. Just go ahead and kill me. These fucking chain gunners. Like, chain gunners from a distance is just hell in this game. And they do it a lot. So that's a yellow key door. Let's look at the map. Oh, hello. Where'd you come from? Have you always been here? Uh, yep. Anytime you walk into an empty, a seemingly empty room in Plutonia, gear up to have a bunch of enemies just girded out at you. By an unforgiving game programmer. Ah. Game designer. Ah. That was risky. I was kind of worried the bro rocket would blow up in my face. Okay. Now that those assholes are dead, I can walk in and trigger the uh, chain gunners that are going to stand up now. Did I save? Why is this quick save not working? Excuse me? Haha. Uh -huh. Why is quick save not working? Haha. -huh. Quick save is not working. Haha. -huh. Quick save. I, I, I was able to quick save just a second ago. And now it is not working. Hit an F6. Bruh. Actual bruh. What the fuck? Hold on. It, you guys saw me quick save. You saw it happen. And now we gotta go in this horrible, horrible options menu again. Quick save F6. Okay, I'm gonna hit F6 and it's gonna quick save because the quick save button is F6. Okay, well, uh, that was a lie. The game lied to me. It's cool. We all lie sometimes. Just wish you would tell me what the actual quick save button is. Like, huh? You guys saw me quick save. I did it. This stream. Like, minutes, seconds ago. And now I just can't. That's annoying as fuck. 
Thanks, GZ Doom. Uh... Spectre snuck up on me and then ran away. What a coward. So what 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 is happening though? Like, does anybody know what's happening in the game? Hate to start it off on a note like this, but uh, holy fuck, can the game work? I would love it if the game would work, so I don't have to sit here, hit save game, type in a save file name every single time I want to save. Full options, miscellaneous options, quick save rotation. Is that... Is that it? I don't know. Nope, it is just... that just doesn't work anymore. Just simply has decided to stop working entirely. Very cool. Thank you. Thank you, GZ Doom. Thank you. Thank you, GZ Doom. Can it work, though? Can it work, though? Jesus Christ. So, so, can it work, though? Uh, like, can it work, though? Can, can it work, though? Like, could it... Maybe, uh, I don't know, work? Maybe? The, the answer's no. The answer is no. It cannot work. So I'm gonna delete... No, we're gonna delete, and then I'm gonna set it to, like, T. Nope, it is just, it just doesn't work. Just literally doesn't work. I think quick save rotation should be off. Wish I knew what that meant. What even is it? Full options menu, miscellaneous, quick save rotation, off. So, so that'll fix it, right? Nope. Okay, well, I was allowed literally one quick save for the entire stream, and then it decided to arbitrarily break. That's epic. That's fucking epic. Holy fucking shit. That's actually infuriating, because why? Usually things have a reason to happen, and don't just happen for no reason whatsoever. I'm not gonna lie with you, fam. That's extremely maddening. Like, I'm not even gonna disguise my contempt for this. That's just pissing me the hell off. Can the game work, please? Like, do I have... Does anybody know even slightly what could possibly be happening because this? Is it like I have too many saves, and I like can't make any more or something? Like how do I delete save games? How, how do I delete them? Because apparently I've like overloaded the fucking system. H how do I do it, please? How do I do it, please? Because I, the, if I click on them, I just go to them. Can, can I... Do you want to delete the save game? Okay. Sure. Yes. Hold on. Sorry, I know this is awesome. I know this is really awesome. I, everybody wants to watch this. But I, I have to? Apparently? So, let's try this, I guess. Holy fucking shit, it still doesn't work. Cool. <sighs> this is awesome, man. I hate it when games function, so this is amazing. This is really amazing. Let's go back to the last time the game arbitrarily allowed me to quick save. Okay, uh, hold on. Now when I hit T, it just takes me to the save menu. Not quickly. Not, not a quick save, but, you know... We might be getting there. So now... Hold on, if I just... If 
Like, I want the actual quick save button to actually quick save, actually. And then full options menu, miscellaneous, right? Uh, save load confirmation off. Wow, okay, uh, I'm gonna put a bullet in my fucking brain. <laughs> so now when I hit F6, it does this, which is, and lest we forget, just a normal save. It's not even the confirmation window for a quick save, it's just a normal save. What the actual fucking fuck? Uh, huh? Like... I feel like it's pretty rare for things to just actually arbitrarily break for literally no reason. Right? But, uh, we've done it. It's happened. It is broken for literally no reason at all. This is innovation in gaming. God damn it. You might have to make one save to make the quick saves to make that the quick save slot. That m makes no sense at all. But okay. Nope, still doesn't work at all. Still does absolutely nothing. It has gone back to doing absolutely fucking nothing when I hit F6. So hitting quick save allowed me to do one long save and nothing else. Which is very cool. Okay. Jesus, fuck. I'm so sorry, guys. I am so fucking sorry. I love that this is happening right at the beginning of the stream. But I'm just gonna go. I've got all my fucking save files in the folder. I'm just going to go right to the fucking source and cut and paste them into a different window, into a different folder. Because apparently this is what we need to do. I don't know. <laughs> Holy fucking shit. Alright, let's play De Blob instead of Troubleshoot. Fun fact about that, in order to d do De Blob, I have to d mod the game myself. There were like a bunch of links where it's like, oh, you know, here's a way to like fix De Blob PC port from being broken. And the first instruction is, open up your hex editor of choice. Thanks. Yeah, this is like when I'm like look up like a self repair for like a retro console. And it's like, okay, so first it's a really simple repair. You're just going to want to get out your soldering iron. And I'm like, uh, okay, all right. I'm not going to be able to actually like get into the level I was on though. Fuck me. And the saves aren't labeled in my browser, so this is gonna be impossible. That's so awesome. That's so amazing. Hold on, get like the quick saves in here. Copy. Like there's not a chance in fucking hell that there's a limited number of quick saves. That's the whole point of a quick save is that you can, like, rotate through them. Okay, now I am allowed one normal save. Fuck me. I guess I'm literally just going to d d manually save every single time. Holy fuck. How frustrating. I was thinking I might be able to just crank out the rest of the game in this stream, but literally without quick save, it's not gonna happen. It's not gonna fucking happen because it takes up so much fucking time with the amount that this game requires you to save and the amount of time it takes to manually save every single time. It's like, oh, kill me now. Just put a fucking bullet in my head, dude. Like, oh my god. That's so annoying. <laughs> and, and by the way, again, I only get to use this a single time. One. One singular time. Uh, here, I think a manual save. Close the fucking game. Delete all the quick saves. I don't know. None of this makes any sense to my understanding of how a quick save is supposed to work. None of it makes a single fucking grain of sense. 
manual. And now, okay, it's just, it's literally completely broken. Like, the game is utterly fucking broken. GZ Doom is not functioning. <sighs> yeah, I just don't even know. And, and there was some completely different window that had something about, like, deleting the confirmation window for quick saves, but we haven't even got to that. We haven't even been able to find the quick save confirmation window, so it's fine. Okay, now F6 does literally nothing at all, whatsoever, at all. It's uh, pr pretty awesome, pretty epic. T does absolutely fucking nothing at all. Jesus fucking Christ. Pretty cool. It's literally going to hinder my progress in the video game, because I'm not going to sit there and manually type out a save every two seconds. Which is how much they want you to save in this game. It is legitimately going to make this take, like, way longer, and that's awesome. Like, actually. No keys are overlapping. I don't know what that means. I mean, I... You guys saw... Again, 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 again. Let me remind you. You saw and I saw with all of our human being eyes. I was able to hit F6 earlier and quick save. And then one quick save later, I just was not allowed to anymore. Illegal. Against the rules. I, I did not change a single binding. I didn't even open the options menu. That wasn't a trap, really. I literally didn't even open the options menu. If you make a save after you hit the quick save button, it apparently sets a quick save slot. Okay, let's do that. Okay, the quick save button does absolutely nothing. It was a, it was a solid attempt, but the quick save button does literally absolutely nothing. I also didn't have to do that before. Ever. I did, like, I literally didn't have to do that before. Assholes. Love when the actual frustrating part of the game is that the developers did not do their fucking job properly. I mean, I'm legit just thinking of swapping to a different game and then figuring this out off stream because it's broken. Like, I, I can't... I kind of refuse to play the game like this. I was so relieved when I actually figured out a way to get quicksave set up last time and then it... It worked one time. The stream... One. One. Like, super cool, right? Lest we forget, these are the same devs who said, Haha, we're not turning off bilinear filtering default because we're assholes. Fuck you. So at least there's goodwill there, you know? At least they're not incompetent and dicks.
I wonder how Revenant missiles are even affected by invisibility. I kind of doubt it has any effect, honestly. <clears throat> like the seeking ones, I mean. I'm, I'm quite sure it's not saving and just not giving me a message, because uh, then there would be a save there, surely. I mean, I think it stands to reason that if it was saving, it would save. But as it stands, we just have these. Actually, uh, is it though? It is now. But it wasn't before. What happens if I just kill myself right now? It did save. But it wasn't before. It literally wasn't before, because there were a bunch of times I tried quicksaving and then killed myself, and it sent me back to a previous save. Excuse the ass out of me? Huh? Okay, so... If I hit F6 now... That's the new save, right there. It literally wasn't doing this before, though. And now it's still- it's supposed to give you a little fucking message up here, too. Like, the, the game is still fucking broken. Is there a way to make the game, like, work? Holy shit. Man, that's, uh... It's really incredible. Well, the game might be temporarily slightly usable for a moment. Yeah, like I'm not even getting messages for picking things up. Like it should be saying, picked up a health bonus there and shit like that. But it just isn't. Anybody know where I need to go in the labyrinthine fucking maze of options menu? T to make the game work? Like, at least now I can play. Try F8. Messages on. Man, I want to go back in the footage and see if it ever said messages off. I guess it wouldn't. It wouldn't if you were turning messages off. I must have accidentally hit F8 earlier. What the fuck? But it literally wasn't quick saving earlier. Like, because I killed myself after trying to quicksave a bunch of times, and it literally just didn't work. So confusing. I hate errors like this where you just... It's, like, impossible to figure out what the fuck's happening. But I think, I think we're back. Here's my theory, is that early on, I hit F8 on accident at some point. And then, there was some other unrelated fucking thing that was also just breaking quicksaves. Either it was having the quicksave file too full, like the folder too full, or something like that. And that was fixed by resetting the game, and then messages were still off, so I couldn't see the quicksaves. Doom Source Port Settings is my favorite horror game. I really don't remember intentionally hitting F8 at any point. But that was like such a- such a fucking like maze to navigate. Of like, what is breaking? How do I fix it? Please, please, God help. Sorry, nobody is more displeased about the last five minutes or ten minutes of stream than I am. Don't worry. I can already hear people typing, oh, why is he so grumpy? But it's like, I, like, I hated that. Like, that was the absolute fucking worst. Uh, okay. Time to actually begin to play the game. Uh, I don't think we actually went into this other room. 
I killed some things in it. Oh no, I did go in there. You need a yellow key to activate this object, okay. I hear a man, okay. Uh, so we have blue key. And there's a blue key thing right there. Imps. What a rare sight. We really don't see a ton of those in Plutonia. Because they're relatively easy to deal with. Oh, fuck you. So the best thing about when something upsetting happens when you're a streamer is then people will get upset at you for getting upset. And it's like, yay. Hello. Ow. It's uh, time to die, bro. Like, last stream, we were just complaining about how the options menu is ridiculously confusing and poorly laid out. Here, it's just fucking broken. Here, the game just refuses to work sometimes. I thought there was health nearby, and there was not. I'm a fool. Okay. It's up here, anyway. That was a bad idea, because now I aggroed these pain elementals while being unable to see them. There we go. Kinda just wasting ammo on this until the guy comes up here. But I also do want to kill them because uh, they are enemies. Okay. And I'll get the rest of those later, just now that they're not spawning them. Okay, I'm just gonna go around getting some getting some health from here and there. And I'm not gonna save quite yet. Until I get up to a, a decent amount of health. <clears throat> okay, oh god. This room looks miserable. Snipe these guys. Again, shotgun, shockingly good at sniping. You wouldn't think it. Oh, I hear a pain elemental. Uh. Homie. Homie. Marge Blimpson. Ow. Okay, Cacodemon made it impossible to see that. Thank you, auto-aim. I didn't want those rockets anyway. Oh, right, that hissing sound is just a general Cacodemon-type sound. I don't even know if Pain Elementals have a specific wake-up sound. They might. Demon type beat. Ow. Oh, good. That is very good. Thank you. Did you see how the shotgun bullets just went in a perfect circle around the chain gunner there? That was some pulp fiction shit. Okay, so now we're gonna play it a little more careful. And look at the map to see where I have and haven't gone. Uh, it's chain gun here. I always, I always think chain gun is four, and that shotgun is three. Because again, my brain is just programmed in Half Life Two. Like weapon swap. I'm just gonna take it nice and easy. This level's giving me tons of shotgun ammo, so. There's no real reason to waste rockets when I don't need to. Okay. This guy's dead meat. 
Okay. And now we can get back to quick saving every single fucking room. Because that's how the game is designed to be played. Legitimately. Like, I want to go watch Dario Casale's playthrough of it. I bet as the dev of the game, he probably will do considerably better, though. And as what I would assume to be a seasoned Doom veteran. Uh... Okay, can't activate that without the yellow. Now we're gonna start quick saving more again. Thank fucking Christ. I think does the boneman like spawn in there after I go into the room? Cool. Dispatch that guy so much faster than I did before. Stop aim at the enemies, please. Please, I beg you. Ah, 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 ah. Okay. Fine, everything's fine. Why wouldn't it be fine? Uh... Okay, and there's all those shotgun- huh. Okay. Now we can actually progress in the game and get back to, I think, maybe being able to actually beat this game today. Because the progress was so slow in previous streams because I was manually saving and thus saving a lot less. And also, I don't know, I thought it was like cool to like not save as much, but apparently everybody saves like every single fucking room in this game. Uh, hmm, is that a homie? That's a homie. Oh, I can do that. What the fuck? How do I get out? That's... fine. I don't even know what I really did there to uh, accomplish that, but I'm fine with it. Okay, oh god, this is the room with all the chain gunners. The room with all the chain gunners. Oh, you mean half the game. Remember that one room in Plutonia that had all those chain gunners? Okay. Oh, still taking damage. Oh. Oh, I was too slow. Uh, is that like a fuck you, you die moment? I think that might be a fuck you, you die moment. Oh, no, nice. Okay, it's operatable. This game uh, is not above just saying fuck you, you die in this pit now. Okay. Nice. Yes, in fight. That Cacodemon just killed both of those revenants for me. It's like the most work a Cacodemon has ever done for me. Because usually they're pretty useless. Uh-huh. Oh, I see boners. This has also got to be one of the worst songs on the uh, Doom 2 soundtrack. It might even be from Doom 1. They used the bunny song from Doom 1. Okay, give me all those. Just grabbing some stuff. Uh, let me quick save real quick because I'm allowed to do that now. Ow! <laughs> We're saving that tiny bit of health. And now, where do I need to go? I've already been down here. We need the red key at the end of that hallway. What's down here? Ah, yes. More pain. <laughs> and 
And again, apparently... Great. A apparently... Great. That is such an awkward angle to do that from, because I literally can't see the enemies at all. So, I, I kind of feel like just not even doing that part. Like, just rocket these guys from here. Uh... There is, like, an alternate music pack, but I kind of... I don't know. One, I kind of don't care. Two, I kind of like most of Doom's base game music, just not, like, this particular song. And, uh... I also want to play it the way that people played it back in the day. Which I still... people have not given me any information on if the Plutonia MIDI pack is, like, official or not. Like, if it's actually part of the original game, but I, I really kind of doubt that. The bunny music. The use of the bunny music is what makes me doubt that. Okay, we can get that for 200% armor. This is the yellow thing. Okay. I, th I feel like I saw the yellow key somewhere, but I don't remember where it is. Ah, yes, up there. There was a, a dude left alive here. God, there's 209 enemies in this damn level. Ooh, let me go this way. Yeah, here we go. This is something. Yeah. Oh, hello. Oh, that let out the boners. Release the boners. There wasn't a homing rocket there, was there? No. Hello, boner. I love their silly little goofy-ass walk. They're such goofy-looking enemies. It's uh, harder to hate them. Um, okay. Now, uh, Plutonia didn't have extra music. Okay, it's like a... Then it's like a modern thing to avoid listening to this song. Okay, now I have yellow key. We're gonna quick save. And we're gonna go do all these yellow things. Hello. Goodbye. Uh, oh, that just leads here, okay. <laughs> Pointless. Pointless. Uh, what is... Does it not look like there's, like, a thick wall there? You guys see that? I wonder if that's a sound hole or something? Huh. Uh, okay. Well, now I can get into this room and actually kill these pain elementals proper. Hee 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 Ah, still chasing me! Still chasing me! STILL CHASING ME! HOW?! How did it do that? The turn radius of those things confuses me sometimes. Okay. Now I- Oh, that's nice. That's really nice. Really good. I'm gonna quick save again. Such an amazing quality of life feature. Uh, finally being able to do something that was very easy in the normal, actual paid release of the game. This is what I get for piracy. I should have bought the, like, floppy disks of Final Doom or whatever. It was probably on a CD at that point, Final Doom. Does anyone know? Okay, we are out of rockets. Which is upsetting, because rocket is like... Rocket launch is like your main source of damage in Plutonia, I feel like. <laughs> he was like, fuck this. I'm getting out of here. Well, you don't have a choice. You're gonna do the chain gun cha-cha with me. As John Ramiro so eloquently put it. Uh, are these... What are these? It's Revenants. Oh, and Archfiles. Yeah, 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 yeah. Can't even see because I'm having two Archfiles target me at once. Uh, this is bad. These corridors are perfectly created just to, like, facilitate the movement of rockets. And I can't even kill myself. What a nightmare. Punch me. Biff. 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 God, their melee attack really has a wide range of, like, amounts of damage it can do. 
Okay, I'm gonna take it nice and easy and just use up all our, like, lesser ammo here rather than using my rockets. That is not lesser ammo. That is rockets. Yeah, just let them come to you. And in a big hallway like this, it's pretty impossible for them to not infight to some degree as well. That's why you tend you tend not to see a huge like cluster of hit scan weapons or of hit scan enemies is because if they're behind each other and they try to shoot at you, they're just going to kill the ones in front. So you'll notice a lot of times we're ambushed by a bunch of chain gunners. They're specifically in like a a, a line that's like perpendicular to you, which is clever evil design. Uh, this speaking of clever evil design, this is. This is some malarkey. It's honestly hard to believe the Half-Life 1 guy made this. Well, there were a lot of Half-Life 1 guys. It was never just one guy. He was just, like, a map designer, I think, or something like that. Uh, okay. Oh, that just is triggered by, okay, just simply moving in that direction. Excellent. How am- how is it possible to not take damage there? BFG? Kill me. Let's BFG their asses. Okay, ooh, nice. Now die. Die right now. Die right now. Fuck you. Oh, that's annoying. Oh, fuck you. Okay. I'm gonna take that. I lost my, like, overheal, but I, I don't really mind that much. That encounter is very difficult to do without taking damage. Almost got away with it, though. Because it was like... I killed one group of them with the BFG. And then... The Archvile... Like, the first Archvile died, and then the second Archvile got distracted... Trying to res the other enemies that I killed. So it kind of worked out. Ow. Why were you allowed to just shoot two in a row like that, huh? Fuck you! Chain gun's better for these guys anyway, because it just keeps them back. Okay, there's those two pain elementals that I was dealing with earlier. I'm gonna quick save before we go in here. Oh! Okay. Thank you, Bus. That was good, I just aggroed that guy and then got out of there instantly. <laughs> uh, hold on. Come in here, you bastard. Those alien bastards are gonna pay for killing my ride. Or whatever the fuck he says. Okay. Was it worth it? Absolutely not. Am I happy for murdering? Yes. Oh, and this... That's not even a path out of here. Damn you, Dario Casali. Uh, I'm gonna quick save and then just check what's around this corner. It's nothing. And I'm that petty. I'm that petty. I'm Tom Petty. Okay. So now we have red key and we can go do red key shenanigans. Ah! Oh, where'd you come from? But genuinely, where did you come from? Don't know. Whatever, we're at 182% health. We're sitting pretty. Hello. It's just like random stuff throughout the level just opens up monster closets with revenants in it. I am looking forward to not having to listen to this song anymore. This is definitely the most, like, grating Doom song so far. Alright. Uh... Let me go to that red door. I, s I assume that we are near the end 
Uh, it would appear there is one enemy left in the entire level, who I assume is an archvile sitting behind this door. No? That's not the actual level exit, though. Uh... What? What? This is just a pillar. The pillar is the final enemy. What are you talking about? Huh? What is this? What? Huh? Help me out here, guys. Shoot it with hit scan. Okay. Yeah, that. Yeah. The fuck is this? What is this game? Who makes this game? Uh. What? I'm really confused. Like. Are there other red doors around? There's another red door. Like, maybe I need to hit a switch elsewhere in the level that will lower that pillar. That's my only guess. Let's try doing that. Maybe that. Maybe that's the switch right there. That probably did it. Okay, we got 100 out of 100 shells. We're, we're doing pretty good for uh, health and ammo and stuff. Oh, and we can top off our armor here, too. Hell yeah. I never really think about armor that much in this game, but it is a mechanic and it does help a lot. Okay, Jesus Christ. I, where even is that pillar room? I forget how to like free look around the map, otherwise I would. Okay, Jesus Christ. When do I get to leave? This is so annoying. This one? Did we hit that before? Finally. Brings me to my last question, which is what is the last enemy? But I don't care. I really don't care. I'm so done with that song. The final frontier. Based. 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 If Mozart was a good composer. So I'm just gonna kill those guys straight away, cause archfiles cannot be revived. There's no way that they're hitting me with the old chain gunner archfile trick. Because they themselves are archviles. Oh, hello. Uh, chain gun's better for this. Unfortunately, I only have ten chain gun bullets. Okay. Uh... This is a waste of bullets. But this game throws shotgun ammo at you like it's no tomorrow. Like there's no tomorrow. So... I don't feel that bad doing this. Okay. Chain gunner scum eliminated. Let's get those shells. Alright. Oh, yeah. Fun game. Fun game. Alright. I, I am having fun. It's just uh, that last level. The music was painful. And we're gonna wanna do this all in one smooth go. I'm actually gonna use the walk button for once. Very rare instance of the walk button being useful in Doom. Fuck you. This is pain. Kill with fire. Kill with fire. Hey, you you alive, bro? There you go. <laughs> One more plasma bolt did it. sound in the world. A pain elemental in pain. 
All right. I see another Revenant. Let's just leave. What hit me there? Felt like a rocket hit me from behind. Maybe the splash damage of my own rocket just barely got me. This feels like a very Doom 2-esque level so far. It's like the chasm. Uh, is this a thing I can do? Yes, it is. I'm gonna regret hitting both of those buttons. Oh, he fell. Stupid dummy fell over. Stupid science nerds couldn't make guy more smarter. Oh god, fuck you. <laughs> what a nuisance. Jesus Christ. This, by the way, way better music for this level. Uh, so... Just wanna see... Okay. Hello, friend. Goodbye, friend of Hagrid. Uh, I'll tell you what I'm gonna do. Hit these buttons, then run. I can't do that? Very cool. Okay, well, there's that try. No, I can't do that because it's too high up. Okay, well... Let me see... What just one of these buttons will do. Hear a fuck ton of these. Which means there's a pain elemental somewhere nearby. There's several. Jesus, this is a tough fucking encounter. Uh, I have a bunch of cell ammo. I'm probably just gonna use that. There's a waste to use it there, but. Annoying thing about pain elementals is that they, uh... They don't really get nearer to you of their own accord very often. They'll just kind of drift around a lot. Okay. Okay. Gonna quick save. I'm fine with that. And then that's the arch fuck. Oh, good. Thank you for not letting me through there, Boneman. That was awesome. Can I, like, aggro you? No. Of course I can't. Uh... And then where does that... I really wish I knew exactly where that little bridge got, like, raised up. Oh, no, it's right here. That's that bridge. And I can't go back there. Because it's slightly too high up. And really, I have nowhere to fucking run here. So I, I don't I don't know what the game wants me to do. Just eat archvile fire, I guess. No, there you go. I was able to squeeze through. Oh god, fuck you. Uh that's not good. Hmm, okay. Seems like pure luck if you get through here or not, but you know. Seems like 100% luck. Like, I really don't know how speedrunners do that part. I'd be curious to see. I guess just use the BFG on this singular enemy. Okay. You done? Alright, tons of rockets. We like that. Uh, how much health we got? 53%? I'm gonna save. Oh, that guy was infighting. Oops. Angry mank fireballs fly across the room. Uh, damn, yeah, that gives us a lot of rockets. Oh, there's a cyber demon there. What the fuck? Cyber- Cyber demon was really shooting at me from there? From that far away? Okay. Oh, there's a button here. I don't know what that's doing. Oh, I see. Ah! 
Oh, that's fun. Is this a very cool Plutonia room where you have to not play Doom for a little bit? In order to win? Oh, but everything's too far away to get hit by auto-aim. This is the classic shen shenanigans conundrum. Can I use... this? Like, does that work? That does work. I can do the most finicky aiming possible. That's so... That's not gonna work out. That's not a thing. We, we don't do that. I think I'm gonna have to just lame out this room, basically. Uh, kill those Mancubi first. It was hard to even tell what they, like, were from a distance. But thankfully we have this pillar for cover. This is way easier than the other... What? The other Cyber Demon fight. Really just hate that there's hit scanners far away, just picking away at me like usual. To the point where... I really would like to kill them. God damn it. But it's so difficult to do. I'm using delete and page down. You know. Normal aim buttons. This is like actually impossible to do. I'm just gonna accept that I'm just gonna get hit a lot. And it's completely out of my control. We're just gonna take it nice and slow and steady. Which runs counter to the fact that I'm just getting picked off slowly and steadily, but what can I do? I guess let's hit this button, pick up the rockets. Uh, if there's any health back here, I would like it, but I don't think there is. It's a little, a little like cubby, a little deposit of shells. Uh, gonna try a really stupid move here. It can be done. There's also... Oh shit, there's a bunch of stuff down here, actually. Whoa, that was amazing. I could do it better, though. <laughs> Damn, that was a high damage roll. Holy fuck. That did, like, 125% or something. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Can I just go straight here? No, I can't. But I could pick that up and go exploring... God damn it. Okay, this is actually very difficult and probably not worth it. Pick that up. Pick that up. Pick that up. Pick it up. Okay. <laughs> there you go. There you go. Finally. Phew. So now we can sort of stock back up. Get all the things. Pick up that supercharge. Oh, there's also an invincibility there. Let's look down. <laughs> uh, okay. This is precarious. It's very much like the chasm. Oh, no, I didn't want to do that. Heck off. Heck of. Okay, you know what? Yeah. I'm gonna take that and just explore. Like, what does this do? Okay. That. Alright, now we save. I don't even care about not keeping the invincibility, this is fine. Walk button is great for that, we got 200% health. I'm gonna call that entirely worth it. Just now... We can go do this segment, and I'm just gonna... I'm, I'm gonna try just running and gunning it while the chain gunner, or while the, uh... Cyber Demon is just shooting rockets at me straight up, no lie. Except there's that asshole. God, that that fucking sucks. <sighs> I'm tempted to just BFG that guy. I think I should. Because, uh... He's just gonna be such a pain in the ass otherwise. Oh god, and there's so many more. There's so many more. Why would you make this? Who makes this? But see how they're all in a row, and they're, uh, they're killing each other like that? That's why they don't get placed like that very often. Okay. 
pretty cool. Damn, I've got that many rockets. I should probably, like, use some of them up here. If they're gonna be spoiling me like that. Oh my god, one of the errant rockets from the Cyber Demon just picked off the Mr. Kako. Okay, uh, I see that button there. But at first... Okay. But first... <laughs> I'm going to try to apparently do this segment again because I forgot to save. Okay, and now let's just chain gun these guys. Let's just plasma gun these guys. Let's just do something to kill them. All right, even better than last time. More than yesterday. Why does he have predictive fire? Why? Why is the chain- why is the fucking cyber demon sentient? I swear he- I swear he does that sometimes. Like, look at that! Did you see him just shoot in a place where I had never stood yet? Now he's shooting those assholes. Maybe that's what it is. He's trying to, like, infight. I don't know. Okay, auto-aim. I'm doing my job. It's time for you to do yours. I thought he was dead for a second. Well, him fighting with that other guy... ...is very good. Okay, now he killed him. Now he's coming for me. Come and mop up, boys. Alright. That's a good point to save at. And I'm gonna go down. Oh god. Oh god, of course. And why wouldn't there be? I'm hitting E. Okay. Boop. I mean, boop. God, and actually there was supposed to be quite a few more chain gunners there. I just killed them earlier. Like an asshole. Why are you in a different spot every time? Fuck you. <laughs> Ugh. I don't want to have half of my health removed by a single chain gunner. Thank you. There you go. Okay. Oh god. Uh, kill it. Kill it with fire. No, not me. Good. Surprisingly easy. Oh, right. I'm invincible to this. Oh? <laughs> what? Oh. Thank you. I know I kind of got hit by my own rocket like a dumbass there, but whatever. Don't really care that much. That revenant in the cage can just stay in the cage. I heard an arch file. Resin fools like an asshole. Okay. Can't go back up there. Oh! Oh yeah. Oh yeah. This is this is BFG moment, I think. Okay, that was like the worst BFG shot possible. Eh. You actually need to, like, wait for the BFG ball to, like, hit something before it will actually kill enemies with the tracers. Alright, uh, can I go back up there? I can. A secret is revealed, really? I could pick up none of it. Oh! Wow. Jesus Christ. I uh, should have quick saved a while ago. Okay, let's see if I can do this part a little better now. Where is that arch file that was here before? Is there a switch that I didn't hit this time? Here we go. There he is! Fuck. Uh, just kill me. I should even be just quick saving, like, after just walking down here. <laughs> Uh, 
Okay. Now I will shoot this asshole when he's nice and far away. Going out in the open against him was a dumb idea. You're not dead? I think a lot of my missiles have been missing. As is their uh, namesake. And I'm gonna attempt shooting this revenant. Up. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. Oh my god, that was hot. Okay. Finally, a way to overcome the terrible auto aim. And now we're not gonna use rocket launcher on this guy. I'm gonna hit that button. This is a very cool secret. Genuinely very helpful. Kind of makes this other supercharge feel pointless, even. Yeah, let's let's hold on. Let me pick this up, then investigate where this takes me. This just takes me back here. Okay, whatever. Is that the level exit in the middle? I think it is. Either that, or there was some armor right next to the entrance that I missed completely. Now, I'm gonna get out the BFG preemptively here. I actually killed that Revenant, haha. -ha. And... Okay, that's worth it. There's that secret. And now, get out of the way, get out of the way, get out of the way. Ah, 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 I don't know what to do. I'm very scared. Goodbye. That's a save right there. Good. 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 Are you still alive? After all these years? I thought you was in the can. Stop. Stop, you're annoying me. There you go. Oh. Anytime you're ready. Okay. We're very close to the end, I believe. Don't know what I gotta do, but we're close to it. Um. Yeah, that is the real exit in the middle there. What part of the level have we not got to? Huh. Okay. Well, there's the exit. Clearly there's some kind of teleport or bridge or something that takes you there. This is it right here. Okay. I just had to go... So, really, I could... Uh... With, with that part that warps you right behind the chain... Or the... I always try to call him a chain gunner. Right behind the cyber demon. You could just walk off of that teleporter and walk right back on and just speed run the level that way, basically. Cool, I don't care about fighting the rest of the enemies. I don't know where they are. <clears throat> okay. The Temple of Darkness. Oh, good. <laughs> Starting off nice and friendly. With some nice easy encounters. Uh, I don't recognize this song, actually. Is this a Doom song? It must be. But I don't, uh, I don't remember where... If this is like Doom 1, Doom 2... Fucking sounds like Chex Quest music. Chex Quest text. Chex Quest text. Chex Quest text. That's what I say every day to, like, do vocal warm-ups. I always like thinking about how every Doom level is designed to be potentially pistol-started. Like, most people don't do pistol starts, but you can, and the levels are kind of structured around it in a way. Who 
shoot? Hmm? Who is shooting me? Uh... Okay... Fascinating. Fascinating. I was checking for some kind of, like, jape wall there. That's all I can really think of, like, what might have caused that. But I couldn't find one. Guess I gotta pay attention to Doom Guy's face, right? Because he faces towards where he's taking damage from. Right here. Wait, no. The fuck? I think there was just an enemy six miles away in the level that was just able to perfectly aim at me every single time. I think that's what that was. I don't see any jape walls there, and now I'm not getting shot at, so... Okay. Uh, there was not an enemy in sight. Like, there was not. I could not see a single enemy, but sure. Oh. Boom, 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 boom. Huh. Okay. This is a nice little happy trail of ammo. Very happy ammo added. See, like, here's the super shoddy. And the rocket launcher was over there. Hey, buddy. Okay, quick save. Now I'm gonna... Oh, god damn it! that one little torch caught the rocket. Stupid. Can I, like, attract their aggro? Hello. So we got tons of rockets, and there's more rockets lying around. So I may as well use them up. Uh. 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 Masterfully evaded. Yet again. Thoroughly japed by the great Repyrus Revenant. Ow. I was too busy sneezing, you fat fuck. Okay. Um, is this hurdy? This is not hurdy ground. Oh, shit. Well, that changes this entire encounter. Okay. I thought that was hurdy blood. Plutonia, pretty inconsistent with that shit. Like, doesn't this feel like it should be hurdy ground? But it just isn't. Okay. Probably wasted some of those rocket boxes there by picking them up when I was at like 99 rockets. Oops. Guess I can't get in there until I hit a switch of some sort. This is the exact same place. Uh, okay. This is a, a weird level so far. Uh, I mean, really seems like that's the only place I can go. Let me explore around here one more time. Cause I don't think I... This is where I like came out. For National Coming Out Day. Yeah, see I like this. Just the, like, it... That one song was just so like aggressive. And it just kept repeating. This is so much more- I love the, like, more subdued tracks. Oh, everything but what I thought was the door opened as a door. Okay. Um... Yeah, wasn't it fun just watching that Revenant just deck an imp in the face? Just like, fuck you, Biff. I didn't mean to do that. Oh god, and he chased me. That was bad. God damn it. I meant to kill this guy before going through the teleport. But it all went wrong. Okay, whatever. 
this like red hot blood that I'm standing on is perfectly safe, apparently. Perfectly safe Hitchhiker's Guide reference. Okay. So now I just gotta go hit that switch again. That switch is kinda out of the way to get. I don't even, this is not the most efficient path, is it? Uh, no, I think it was. Okay, habada 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 habada. Now I'm gonna kill these Hell Knights and then quick save. Uh, what the fuck ever, I can just quick save whenever. I don't need to do that thing where I'm like, alright, I'm gonna do this and then save. That's the whole point. I'm sorry? Is there a revenant up there? I swear I, I saw a revenant missile just sail through the air and hit me, but all the revenants are dead at the moment. Okay. Uh, and I am just gonna shotgun this guy because uh, he's not he's not worthy of my rockets. You don't have enough badges to train me. There you go. Oh, look at this. This is uh, a teleport that looks like a level end. But of course it's not the level end, because that would be silly. Uh... Okay, I heard them yell. Don't actually see them anywhere. Oh, there they are. This is bad. Should have just BFG'd him. Would have been way more efficient. In fact, yeah, I, I'm gonna be a, I'm gonna be a jackass here and reset. So let's start out with the rocket launcher. Kill the Baron just standing here. And then, oh, oh, that Baron is the one at the end of the hallway here. That wasn't one that like followed me through the teleport. Okay. Wacky. Still took a ton of damage, though, and I would rather not. I would really rather not. You, you're alive, then. That's... that's real. Good god. Oh my god. Jesus fuck. Can you die, sir? Okay, please, please let me through. Oh god! Uh, uh, they're killing each other. They're killing me. This is misery. It's just so hard to switch to the BFG. Maybe I should just, like, not rocket that first guy. Like, that's just not worth it. Jesus. Okay. Uh, this room is pain. Cool. For some reason he just decided not to shoot that time. Okay. Now slowly scroll up to a weapon I actually can use. There was a way to just turn off the pistol. Just disable the ability to swap to the pistol, because it's useless. There's there's no reason to use the pistol. I think legitimately no reason. Like, yeah, it's slightly more accurate than the chain gun, I guess. But even then, the chain gun is still just better. Oh. Is there one in every single one of these? There is. Um... I mean, that was still... very sloppy, but I... it, it doesn't feel like I'm really capable of doing much better than that. I am using keybinds, but uh, here's how long it takes to swap, swap, swap weapons. 
that long. That's enough to take, like, 200% damage. That, that's enough time to die to all of these enemies. Just straight up die. Okay, look at that, though. That's hot. Love taking no damage. And then we can actually use these as health bonuses. Which is satisfying. These guys just have barely enough health to not kill... Get killed by a normal shotgun blast. I'm so spoiled by Valve games where they just swap the weapon rather than having this whole thing where the weapon needs to like go off to a nice vacation in Tahiti and file its taxes and meet meet a lovely girl weapon and uh, and, and, and have a, a loving caring relationship with three children with them and then it's ready to swap. Oh? What does that accomplish? Huh? Does entering this from another side? Okay. God damn. Yes, entering that teleport from the other side takes you to a different spot. That's whack. I feel like I've not seen that before in Doom. Okay, super shotgun is preferred here. Thankfully, you can hit those- you don't have to wait for the walls to scroll down, you can just hit them instantly when the wall has scrolled down like a single pixel. There, I fudged it because I got too far away. So these little pillars actually have a purpose in that wall, I guess. That's weird, the directional teleporter. Okay, I feel this is a BFG moment too. We've been seeing a lot more use for the BFG lately. Cool. That's hot. Pretty sure if you want to do this without taking damage at all, you're just shit out of luck. Maybe there's a strategy for it. Is that the actual level exit? That is the actual level exit. What? I can just go? I kinda- now I kinda don't want to. Let me try saving and just see if that's the level exit. Oh, I can't walk up there. I see. Need to lower it. All right. Maybe I should have been using the BFG more throughout this playthrough, honestly. Because it's great for just, uh... Any situation where it's like, how am I supposed to deal with that in time? Any of those, like, trick teleports and shit. I need a blue key. Okay, I see a red key there, blocked off by yellow doors. Uh, we're no closer to the truth. But you can rocket jump there? I, maybe. Rocket jumping in this game doesn't actually give you much height, does it? I guess if you use, like, look up, look down keys, then you can. Uh, let me just try it for kicks. Because in original Doom... Like, Doom 1, I think there was not the ability to do this. Yeah, yeah. And you can do this without... You can do this, like, taking less damage, too. But look at that. Boom. <laughs> but we're not gonna do that. We're not gonna do that. That's cheesy. I do like that it highlights the last save that you took. That's a nice thing. Good quality of life. Bit of a waste of that, uh... Berserk pack. But oh well. Ow. Okay, that's why you don't do that, typically. Uh... But there's some frickin' epic rocket jumps that you see in, uh, speedruns. Okay, you're forced to take that, sadly. Now, I can't even see the path here. 
which makes this rather difficult. <sighs> well, this is fun. Ow. I'm sounding a lot like the pain elemental right now. Ow! Ow! <laughs> It's a war of attrition. Die. Die, motherfucker, die, motherfucker, steal, fool. Okay, we're just about out of ammo for this. Good. And clean up the rest with this. Probably would have been more efficient to use the BFG. I probably only had one or two BFG shots there, but... Okay. I'm going to stick with it. We're going to save. Bum, bum, bum. See, now I would have liked that Berserk pack. Fuck you. And I, I can't see where this leads. Uh, great. I gotta hit end. Okay. Oh, this is so finicky. Doing this part. Fuck you. <laughs> this is an asshole game. Okay. Is this wall gonna open up? This seems like a very suspicious wall. That's totally gonna lower and there's just gonna be like a billion chain gunners. Chain gunner in jail where he belongs. No? Oh, but we got all those fun friends up there. Bum, bum, bum. Oh, I see. Alright. Time to start picking them off! And I assume there's a yellow switch I have to hit somewhere. Because there were those bars earlier. Spitting bars. Just like Eustace from... Encourage the Cowardly Dog, famed rapper Eustace. Well-known hip-hop artist Eustace, found dead in his LA apartment this Sunday. Authorities suspect it was a drug overdose. That's right, Eustace does crack. Okay. Hey, that room wasn't so bad. Can I get up there? There's cell charge up there. Hmm. How do I get that? Weird. Uh... Okay, I'm surviving. And that's sometimes, some days... All you do is survive. Let's just see if I can open this. No, I cannot. Gotta hit the yellow button somewhere. I guess I have blue key as well. Now we can hit that switch. Uh. Is this the yellow switch? That's the yellow switch. That's funny. Okay. Oh! Yeah! Cool! Yeah! Woo! Yeah! Woo! Yeah! Woo! Fuck. Uh, Eustace does rap. This is real, by the way. Someone said they never want me to make that sound again, by the way, when I made the imp noise. And can I just say, in response to that... Not taking any chances with you. Did, did you like how when I teleported there? First off, that was not a green teleport. That was like one of those weird instant teleports. Uh, did you like how I just froze up? Like, I just didn't even do anything because I was so shocked. I don't know why I was shocked. You really shouldn't be. It was just the fact that I teleported to a different room instantaneously was the part that really got my goat. The 
chain gunners are just kind of killing each other in the background there, and I like it. I also like how every enemy has the same pain sound. Revenants surely have no vocal cords with which to go Urgh! But yet they go err anyway. Okay... What? The splash damage hit him, but only barely. Eat piss. Oh! Jake Wall, fuck you. Those walls... are dumb. I want to call them illusory walls, but they're like the opposite of an illusory wall. I guess they still are kind of illusory. Uh... Yeah, they all have red blood, including the cacodemons, which clearly bleed blue when you kill them. It is true. I know Brutal Doom fixes that, right? Makes it so the Cacodemons bleed blue. Uh, okay. Cool. Fuck. They just kill me. Uh, see, they're not all, like, grouped together, which makes this not a certified BFG moment. And also, yeah, it, it's not a teleport, it, but it does some weird instantaneous bullshit there. Oh, there's a Megasphere there. That changes everything. That changes absolutely everything. God, the splash damage really got me there. Uh, there's just not, like, a safe spot here. I guess back up. I guess backing up is the way to do it. Yeah, that's that's our strat. So you walk it, walk onto this, then instantly. Oh. Uh. <sighs> okay. So I could actually kind of cheese those guys. Let's watch the fl the floor instantly go away. Oh no, I didn't didn't hit that trigger point that time. Yeah, kill each other. Yeah, kill each other. Nice. And then I'll pick off the winner. Okay, well, you know what? I like that. That's cheese, but I don't care. Maybe you should have designed your level so it couldn't have that done to it, Dario. Mate. Okay, here we go. And now, I don't need to end this with a ton of health. Because we're gonna pick up that Mega Sphere in the end. Okay, hot, hot, hot. Everybody, hot, 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 everybody. The song used to annoy the shit out of me when I was a kid, by the way. Okay, and then this, oh, I don't have enough for the BFG. That sucks. Where's the shotgunner? Huh? Sh shoddy? 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 Where are you? Legitimately, where is the enemy? I know I'm gonna die here, but... Okay. Uh... How about I... Go in there, aggro these bones... That I didn't even know existed. Oh. I, I love- I love getting shot by literally, and I mean literally, nothing. I love when the concept of nothing picks up a fucking gun, busts out the strap at me. Okay, so then... That's so douchey. In other words, it's a perfectly normal plutonia room. Oh, that's hot. Oh, that's hot. Sad thing is, I don't think I'm gonna be able to, like, get to... Oh yeah, bone. Oh come on, shoot the bone! I can see the bone! This is bullshit. This is fucking bullshit. Like, what am I supposed to do here? I can see him very obviously and clearly. Shoot the enemy, game. 
Do I gotta do your job for you? What the fuck? There you go. Was that so hard? Um... There's, there's still another one there. So I don't know what I'm gonna do about that one. Might just have to waste some of the health from the Megasphere. Cause those guys are guarding... ...a radiation suit. But... I'm not gonna be able to, like, get it in time. So we're just gonna sacrifice some of that health from the Megasphere, fuck it. There's just a- there's just an invisible shotgunner there. It's pretty cool. D really don't know what the game wants from me there. But whatever. I'm just gonna ignore it. We're just not gonna get 100% kills because, uh... Fuck that. This must lower that floor. Okay. Well... Wish I could have done that better, but it really felt like I made the best of it and still didn't come out on top. 123 out of 124. Yeah, there's an invisible guy shooting me. That's the 124th. No idea. Bunker. All right. What do we got? What level is this? 26? And how long has this gone on for? Uh, maybe, uh, maybe there'll be one more stream of this. That, that just seems like the more comfortable option. Because you gotta remember, not only is there the last few levels of the WAD, there's also the bonus levels that I want to do. Good, thank you. It's what I get for walking around a corner. Blue key. Probably couldn't squeeze through there, if I had to guess. Imp, I don't know how you found your way down there, but you sure did. Uh... I was gonna be real pissed if this liquid hurt me. Okay, that seems... Largely pointless. That's just the way to get out of the pit. It's just like Harry Potter PC 1. This is just like Harry Potter PC 1. Ow. What's up with that? Kinda thought that was gonna teleport me. Oh, hello. Hey, dickhead. Can Arachnatrons get revived? I think they can. I'm in the trenches. Uh... Weird. This is a weird level so far. It's more trenches than bunkers. But I'll take it. Uh... I'm not gonna save yet, because I don't know what's happening. Huh. I don't know if I've, uh, screwed myself over or not. It's just a, a wild assortment of enemies. Normally this game likes to throw one of a lot of the same type of enemy at you. Oh god. Here we're just getting the lot. Okay, and I'm actually out of shotgun ammo. And chain gun ammo, which is upsetting. You know, I, I'm gonna say it, actually, this area kind of reminds me of the way some areas in Half-Life look. 
like opposing force specifically. Which I don't know if Dario Casali worked on that, because that's mostly Gearbox. With very little involvement from Valve. All I have is rockets. This is an awesome song, by the way. What's up with these pillars? They look weird. Ow. Well. This one has blood on it. Yep, okay. That's something. Guess we're using one rocket per lost soul here. Cool. Alright. I have detected a secret. Huh. Cool. Oh, that's a megasphere. That's a megasphere. That's a megasphere. I'm actually gonna take a manual save. Guns! Bastards. Those alien bastards. The fuck is the point of that little hallway, huh? This... Am I going crazy? I'm on crack. <sighs> yeah, I think we'll do... Comfortably, there will be one more stream of this. Because those bonus levels are going to take a while, I think. Here we go. Finally got some ammo. Uh, this is a very unique level. Strange design to it. Did I already go in there? No. It's got that underhulls vibe, too. Underhulls type beat. You know I'm jaded by this game, when it locks me in a room with, like, five of these assholes, and I just don't even blink. Like, that's nothing. Alright. Can't pick that up. There's some really confusing rules to the armor in this game, but the long and short of it is that blue armor is better armor and like overrides green armor or something like that. I, I don't even remember. I know the blue armor is like super armor. Rockets actually go all the way through there? Ow, there was a pillar behind me. Cool. Ow, cool. Come on, I gotta like... Gotta fucking like wipe and blow my nose, but there's this game will not give me a second to breathe. Uh, 
Okay. This is not a game that is conducive to scratching your nose while playing. Because if you take your hand off the keyboard for one half a second, there will be ten revenants waiting to bone you. Another one down here? No. Oh god, speaking of ten revenants waiting to bone me. Die. <laughs> There's also an archfile out there who's gonna revive everyone. BFG moment. Archfile dead? Where's the Archfile? Where'd he go? Oh god. Oh god. Finally some good fucking food. Really? 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 Huh? Oh. Auto-aim, uh, is really being a bitch in this particular instance. I think I'm just gonna not fight those guys. ATM. And now I'm way back in the level. In fact, I think I'm going backwards. But we can grab some health from earlier on that we probably would have not grabbed otherwise. I always thought about health packs count towards the percentage of items, right? I know like enemy drops don't count, but health packs do, I think. Which means to get a 100% item clear run, you like need to take damage, I think. Because you can't pick up health unless you get hit. Okay, now I'm back here. Uh, this is a very maze-like level. That Revenant got really excited to see me and then left. I'm really thankful Revenants are not more powerful than they already are, like, in, in terms of the amount of health they have. Because uh, they could be even more obnoxious. You need to count your blessings on situations like this. Okay, I think this slurm does not hurt me. This is looking like a great time to save. Does this do anything? Ah, okay. <laughs> Big level. Big level. Probably gonna be my last one for today. And then we'll do Isaac daily. Oh, wait. Oh, wait. Haven't gone down here, I don't think. No, I actually did just go through there. Just now. And is there anything in this room? Oh, yes, chain gunners. Why wouldn't there be? Well, it's, uh, it's a maze, but I have somehow not got stuck yet. I'm just kind of wandering around, doing what I can. Are we, like, slowly lowering this, or am I going crazy? I'm probably going crazy. Plutonia made me go poop. We always knew it was going to happen, just didn't think it would be with Doom. You know what? No, I don't have cell ammo. I was going to BFG these guys, because it was just too much of a pain in the ass. 
They're going down. Slowly but surely. Okay. Now, I could probably... Oh, I hear them teleporting. Oh god, oh fuck. Oh god, oh fuck. And you know what? Yeah, I'm gonna do this. Fuck you. Game probably didn't want me to do that, but, uh... Design your level better. I'm only using the tools given to me in classic Doom. I hear a big boy. Okay, there's the Archie. Can't wait until life after Archie. Okay, he's dead. Thank God. I fucking hate that guy. And I guess that way with the Arachnotrons is the way I need to go. Huh. How'd you get down there, Bone? How'd you get down there? Oh! Same way I got down here. He fell. But actually, how did a bunch of enemies get put down there? Weird. What, what is this? Huh? Is this like Archfile shenanigans where he like rezzed a bunch of them and they... Is there an Archfile just running around rezzing enemies everywhere? Is that what's currently happening? I'm gonna be so pissed if it turns out there's just one Archfile just running around undoing all the progress in the level. Fuck! Well, that sucks. Hmm. Okay, where's that blue key room? Let's go there, grab the blue key again. I don't even really care about killing those guys again. Frankly. And neither should you. Okay, so now, out of this whole maze, where's the blue door? It's out there. Uh... Now the real question is, how do I get there? Uh... This way will take me there. No, I, I need to like go into the trenches, but that's not actually a room that has access to the trenches. Here we are. Oh, hello! It's that teleport. It's Those are enemy teleports in the ceiling. That's what's going on. Owie. I still think Revenant Fireballs just don't have splash damage. It really seems like they don't, at least. Or if they do, it's like pathetic amounts of it. Jesus fuck, you think you got enough dudes there? Huh, what's happening? Uh... Uh, still need to go around a little bit more. Really hoping for a mega sphere. I know this game only gives you like five of those across the entire game, but still hoping. Okay, the blue switch has been hit. What did that do? <laughs> uh great. I see the level exit over there, actually. In fact, earlier, when I was in that... When I killed the Archfile and I was in that little Arachnitron battle zone, I think, could I have just... beaten the level right there and then? If I had known? Nice. That guy went down way easier than I thought he would. Okay, uh... Gonna really hope this is not a huge ambush. No, this is just this room again. That's the red switch. Which I cannot do anything with yet. Oh, I'm fatigued. 
I'm hitting I'm hitting the doom fatigue. So going out of here. Take the stairs up. I'm tempted to save, but I am at only 12 yeah. HP, which is probably unwise. Okay, now I have no excuse. 22. Oh. And 100% armor. Is this just to open the door again? Oh, okay. That's just to undo the mean trap that they laid on you there. Oh! When you hear a door opening like that, you gotta be suspicious. We fought these guys before. A scrap of health, sir. A crumb. Please. Yeah, I'm gonna save. It's unwise, but I'm gonna save. Ba -ba -ba -bum -bum. Ba -ba -ba -bum -bum. Not every map is, like, amazing in Plutonia. Uh, there were some maps that were really, really fun, and then some of them are just kind of sloggy. Oh, shit. Oh, God, it's one of those rooms. Oh, God. Okay, BFG moment. I don't have any cell ammo. But hey, at least that is something to do. This is something to work towards. Toward. Okay, just teleport in here, you bastards. Cool. Just take two at a time. Bruiser Brothers at a time. It's funny to me to think that there's any encounters in Doom that are like named encounters. Like, that's one specific demon. These are the Bruiser Brothers, you know? Like, that's cute to me. Because the, the demons are so, like, generic and nameless, usually. This is simple. Simple and clean, just the way I like it. That's... nothing? Okay. It's just a nice little secret. The sounds of revenants ringing in my ears, making me go deaf. Okay, now we're back here. And... Ostensibly near-ish to the end of the level. Although I don't know for sure. Oh god, it's this part. Uh, I'm gonna save like an asshole. Uh, where are all the enemies? I mean, I'm not complaining. Maybe it's after I cross like a certain threshold there, but we're at 100% health again. Only got one blast of this shoddy left, though. Better make it count. Plenty of chain gun ammo. So it's fine. So these teleports right here, they're not meant for me. They're meant for the enemies. And, uh, once I cross a certain line... Tons and tons of them will spawn in. There's the exit. Looks like I do need to hit the red switch finish the level. Oh. That were a close one. But I don't even know what the trigger point is for those enemies. And I might have to loop around the level now, sadly. Could just jump here, but uh we don't we don't want to do that. That's illegal. Oh. Yeah, Revenant rockets are not actually explosives. That's how it feels. Uh, oh, what's, what's up with that in there? Huh. Okay, I'm using jump to look. Right after saying jumping is cheesy. Okay, I'm just gonna keep going in a direction until I find a way up. Maybe this is, like, the less efficient way to go around it. 
This is one of those levels that really drags on and on. Uh, no, this is just this. I hear enemies. Just go to where the enemy sounds are. Only zero out of three secrets. That's bad. A measly zero. That's the Jape Room. I hear you, bony bastards. I hear them. I hear them. Where they be? Yeah, these shotguns are worth picking up. Whoa, a bit of lag there. Here we go. Oh, yeah? You really gonna do that to me? You really gonna do that to me right now? Fuck you. Huh. Oh, and I, I didn't save, so that actually took me back quite a ways. Not super far. They really did that shit. They really on that gay shit. It's a reference, don't kill me. Alright. Uh, well, I guess we're doing this again. I shouldn't have even crossed over here. I'm a dummy. You really on that gay shit? So I feel- ah, uh, I feel like I did figure out the way to go and then just... threw it all away for nothing. was around this part. Right, because there was that door. Where's the funky looking red blue door? Here we go. Alright, save. And start spawning in these lads. Oh my god, the, the crushers start before you even... That's so bad. What am I supposed to do? Like, when do they start? Who shot me? I'm sorry? Who just- I just took damage, but to whom? Excuse? Who be shooting me right now? <laughs> what? This is- this door is just a pain zone. Why? Why would you do that? Huh? Who would do this? I know there's a- there's an archway- there's like an unintentional part, uh, in Doom 1. What the actual fuck am I supposed to do there? What is the win scenario? Like, can- I don't think I can squeeze to the side of these. No, I can't. Just guaranteed damage moment? Like, they go down so fast. I'm like, determined to do this. That's such a dick move. It's like, stand right here. And then stand right there again, which is very hard to do. That's so fucked. I know there's also an arch vial. There's like, it's funny, in Doom 1, there are like pictures of arch vials on the walls without there actually being arch vial enemies. Uh, and... The... There's one of them that, like, damages you if you stand next to it. Okay, um... So I'm still- I'm gonna go hit that red switch, cause fuck it. People are saying apparently one of the sides of that thing is open. I don't know why it would be designed like that, but apparently it is. Some- some parts of Plutonia feel like they were thrown together by, like, a... 
like an AI, you know? Uh, okay, I guess go down here. No, that's right. That's not the right room. And there's a bunch more enemies down here, right? No, just a couple. Mm, here they are. They're on the other side. Here we go. There's the pain. Ah. Oh god, fuck you. We're redoing this part. I can't look up, by the way. Unless I take my hand off of the mouse. So, I guess we're doing that. I guess we're doing this. That little doorway is so annoying. There, look, I used the weapon swing trick. Jesus. Uh, right. Keep forgetting. Oh, that corner is also safe. That's the, like, human way to do it. Okay. For some reason, that corner is safe, even though it doesn't really make sense. If I, like, can't... Because it stands to reason that if I can't squeeze into here, then there's not enough room between me and the wall. Okay. And now I'm just gonna... Brute force my way through there. Yep, we're gonna quick save again. We are actually doing that. Now, let me just look at this. Hmm. Why would they do it like this? Like, was there... Were there bars there, too? It looks like it. So maybe you only need one of the keys to end the level or something? That's so bizarre to me. But... I'm gonna go do the rest of the l Huh? Oh. It's a strange way to do it. I feel like that's very atypical, uh, Doom level design. This is fine, it's letting us kill more goons. What is, uh, happening? Are those the crushers or something? Like, why do I hear moving platforms? Okay. Get me out of here. Red switch. What do you do? What is it exactly that you do around here? And I can just smell a secret there, but I don't know how to get to it. Hmm. Don't know. Uh... Maybe I can just... okay. I love just hearing the crushers constantly. And by love, I mean I hate it. I'm going backwards. But I don't know where... I guess really all that that red switch did was lower those bars. I kind of doubt it did anything else. Or raise those bars. Half-Life 2, raising the bar. Kind of thought it would like open up one, that secret with the mega armor or something. But it didn't. But it didn't. Are all the enemies dead? No, I got three left. Wonder where they are. Wonder who they are. Wonder what they're doing now. Mm. It's probably just time to end the fucking level. 
Okay, that's that's something. Having 100% health. I don't know where the last few guys are, and I don't really feel like chasing them around. Well, whatever. That was probably wasted time, but... Weird. Weird level. I, I don't know why it's like that. And I think I'm gonna call it there. Antichrist. Cool. Three imps playing poker. I like that. They're just sitting there playing poker. And uh, this is what we get to look forward to next time. I just saw a BFG fly by my face. Jesus Christ. Okay, yeah, this... Jesus, Antichrist. This level's gonna be intense, and I don't really feel like doing it right now. So next time... We're close to the end of the game, though. Because we got... There's only 30 maps total, so there'll be five more levels. Because it's the three three more base game maps, and then there's the ultra-hard uh, secret levels. Which, I almost wonder if those should just be their own stream. But whatever. Uh, so, yeah, thank you for watching. I don't think there'll be another stream today, if I had to guess. Uh, probably just gonna chill with Boo. I'm going to save. God, all that quick save bullshit at the beginning was so frustrating. I'm glad that just fixed itself. Uh, end of stream five? I think this is stream five. Uh, next time, I'm gonna go ahead and say I guarantee we will finish Plutonia. And uh, then I will never play it again. Because fuck that. As neat as it is, I will probably never play this again. I, uh... If I had done this on Hurt Me Plenty, then I would have considered maybe then doing a second run on Ultra Violence, but... Nah. As it stands, fuck that. It probably would have been a good idea to do it on Hurt Me Plenty first, but... Whatever. I am not a smart man. Uh... So, is anybody streaming right now? Mmm, Germa. Somebody streaming Scorn. Everybody's streaming fucking Scorn. I have not heard of this game in, until yesterday when Andrew streamed it, and then I saw Vinny did it, and Germa is doing it. Why is Germa streaming a horror game? Like a serious horror game. How does that work? Weird. Alright, I'm gonna follow this one. Weird, I had, this game came out of nowhere. Uh, a lot of people have been asking if I'm gonna do like horror games for October. I'll, I'll do a few spooky games. I got two very similar looking games, Limbo and Closure, that I want to play. They're both pretty cool. Both like puzzle platformers that are more spooky than horror. Because as I've said before, I think horror games are pretty much almost always bad. Like I just don't enjoy them. Or it, it, maybe bad is a too too harsh of a term, but I just don't personally enjoy them. Uh, but yeah, we're, I think we're just gonna go raid Germa. Fuck it. See if we get another cool shout out so I can get that cool serotonin. Uh, slash raid. I still got all caps on. And next time, I, I might just do more Plutonia tomorrow just to finish it off, because I'm ready to be done with this. And uh, TNT Evolution never... Uh, people have been saying, oh, do you want to do some other, like, harder wads or other, like, wads? Oh, there's, like, fan-made Plutonia sequels and stuff. Mm, no, I don't really care about doing that. I I'm more interested in, like, experiencing significant parts of gaming history, at least at the moment, maybe in, like, the far future, if I'm really, if I'm really starving for more Doom, then I will, uh, maybe check those out, but I don't really feel like doing, like, Kaizo Doom and shit like that. Uh, what does WAD stand for? It stands for Where's All the Data? And that is actually true. It sounds goofy as fuck, but that is literally what it stands for. Anyway, let's go raid Germa. We're gonna see him play something spooky. I don't I don't know how that works when it's Germa, but I guess we'll find out. Take it easy, guys.